No cover charge, no dress code, just the hottest mix in Madtown. Friday Night Fire, 931 Jams. Madtown, your boy DJ Fusions on your radio. It's the top of the hour, so we got an exclusive interview to bring you. We got actor, singer, songwriter, Dollface with a new single for you, Madtown. This is Madtown's number one for hip hop, 931 Jams. So without further ado, let's get Dollface on the line. Hi. We got your new single here with Baby Bash. Get used to this. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about who produced the record and what inspired you to write this record? I produced it along with a, a producing partner. His name is Davi. He's a young and up and coming, really talented um, producer. We've done. We did the last single that I did with Snoop um, together. We are kind of like just that special mix, you know, he gets me, I get him, and really good chemistry, but the, the single, um, Get Used to This, actually that was inspired by my lifestyle, it's really what I'm doing right now. I can dig it, I respect it. Uh, so working Thanks. with Snoop and E-40, you know, what was that like, you know, having your previous records with major artists, uh, you know, coming up with, with good collabs? You know what, it was really a great experience, um, I had people who were working for True Vision Media Group, you know, some of the... Um, guys that had previously worked for Jive and Interscope for years, so naturally they had relationships with artists and um, they saw True Vision, you know, in me, my company. Um, so, you know, they lended some of their contacts and E40 naturally came first. Very professional. Um, the experiences were similar with E40 and Snoop, you know, they. Um, they were walking into a new situation. Here's an independent girl, you know, they don't know if I'm gonna have them on a tacky set or have them, you know, come do a record and it's not gonna be hot. But um, they really, both of them were really good to me. And I mean, they really gave me more time than they agreed as far as, um, you know, when they came to do the video, I know Snoop had, um, his contract said like three hours or something crazy and he was there for nine and E-40, they both just stayed like the whole, as long as I needed them, they were there. So it was just, you know, fortunate for me that these guys really were class acts. They were so cooperative. You got everything you need, you need anything else, can I help you, you know? So it was a great experience all across the board, uh, yeah. So we've, we've checked out your Twitter account. We see you got over 120,000 followers on Twitter. They got a big thing going on in Japan, and you guys didn't service any of your records to Japan, so how, how does that feel to have another country just taking your record over by storm? I was shocked by that, because actually before Japan, Australia hit me and said, you know, we want to license one of your records. We heard the single with you and Snoop, and we want to get in business with you, and this was about six months ago this was in the summer in july and i was like whoa and then you know just with this whole viral world how your stuff could just get, end up in another country i was like that's cool all right was there anything else that you want to let people in madison know you want to give them your twitter address or your facebook address so some fans can reach out and hit you back find out where to get your records where they can see you in what cities they can follow me on twitter which is uh my twitter name is dolphin music and um, Facebook, you know, they can follow me um, under Dolphy. So the new single, Get Used to This with Baby Bash.